Hello everybody, welcome back to Chipogo. I'm just going to give our fields some fertiliser as they needed it. We're still in the same month as last time, it's still raining. But I've got our fields to fertilise and there's a contract on field 53 which is a big, biggish field. So we're going to accept that contract and get that done and then we got to uh, cut the grass turn that into hay because we got two cow barns now and uh, we we're going to acquire lots of straw lots of silage and lots of hay so let's get, all, get, let's get these fields fertilised and we'll get we'll set the contract we'll get that done in the same time I'll finish this field and I'll purchase a couple of bags of fertiliser and we'll run back get filled up and then um, yeah uh, save the game right go to contracts we'll set this field 53 £12,060 accept I'll show you what field it is it's this big one here what's it what's it got growing in it it's I don't know. Pass lips. Tricky cow. Right. Get a couple bags of fertilizer. Big bags. Of fertilizer. Two. Let's go. should complete this contract any second. With a bit of luck. Yeah, there you go there. Contract completed. Let's collect the contract. £12,060. Oh well. We haven't finished the contract, so that must have been just a warning that we've done a certain percent. I didn't read it, I was just expecting it to be done. Six percent, no, sixty-three liters. Hopefully, these sixty-three liters will complete the contract. There must be a bit up here. Right, 
I would have thought that was that, uh, it's not that big, a bit we missed. Hopefully this will complete it. Got the times time 15. didn't complete the contract. Ah, run out of fertilizer. Well, we'll have to run back to the farm, won't we? And get some. 63 litres. Right, see you, uh, I'll see you back at the uh, at the field when we fill the fertilizer and we are fertilizing the last the last uh, what percentage we've got left to do three percent. See you back at field fifty three with a full tank of fertilizer. Let's get the sprayer turned on so we can see on their map where we need to go. How much is 3%? Will this be the 3% we need? No. I don't think I missed that much over in either. Come on, not 100% or 98%. Still 98. I think this is the last bit. Still on 98. Oh my god. Let's have a look on the thingy map. Don't say. Well, that don't help because it don't say. So we just need to go around and hope for the best that we uh, cover something. Oh, I don't know. To me, I've done all the field. I'll be a bit somewhere. Only two percent. There must be a bit at the start. I think I think I've covered everything though. Come on, just give me that 2%. Before I run out of vertilizer again. Here we go. Right at the top there. Yes, 
Is this going to complete it? Yes. Now we can collect the contract. Collect. So really, yeah. Let's get back to the farm. We'll jump in the cl class, and we'll um. mow our fields and make some hay. See you at the class. Well, welcome to May, everybody. I've uh, moved forward. We're just going to check on the ladies quickly. Oh, that field still ain't ripened. Why aren't you ripened? Oh. I did plant green rye. I thought this was um, wheat or barley. So we got four grass fields to mow and this green rye to mow. So we're going to do hay in every field. We don't need silage, but the next cut of the green rye and all the grass fields will go into the next two pits to make silage. These cows are looking good. 53,000 litres of slurry, 44,000 litres of straw, 52,000 litres of food. And these ladies over here, they've got 48,000 litres of food, five, nearly 6,000 litres of milk, straw, and 11,000 litres of slurry, and we've got 54,000 litres of manure. So once we've mowed our green rye and our grass fields, we could potentially spread manure on them or put slurry on them. So, nice. So yeah, I'll break away in the time lapse. I'll, uh, I won't time lapse doing all the mowing. I'll probably show two fields, three fields being mowed and then uh, I'll do a couple fields being tethered and then probably another two being bowed. So I'll see you when all the mowing and the tedding and possibly the bailing is all completed. Let's, oh, let's go. Why aren't you working? Oh, I need to unfold it. Ah, here we go. Here we go. Right, let's go. Oh right, so we got rain on his way. So I'll get this fill quickly done before it starts belting it down and then we'll, I'll go and have my dinner break. And hopefully the rain will pass and we can come and we'll start the tethering. We'll put this on the worker in the last field and then we'll get tethering. So I'll come back to you guys when we're in the field tedden and I'll decide if we're doing all fields hay or putting two of the grass fields in the bunker so see you as soon as it stops raining all right here we are it's quarter to 11 now 
The rain was only supposed to have been for 10 minutes. It should have been finished at 7 o'clock, but it didn't finish till half past 10. But we're back in the last field, getting it mowed. So I'll get this one done off camera, and I'll see you when we're Ted and, Ted and their first field. I'm, I still haven't decided if we're doing all the fields um, hay, or we're going to do one of them as silage. If we do silage, I think I'll do the green rye as the silage. So I'll get this done and I'll come back to you, as I say, when we're um, Ted and Ted and their first field. All right, let's get these mowers put away. They, they need washing, really, but I ain't got a jet wash yet, so, oh, wrong attachment. Oh, what? Oh, my God. Right. Thank you. Before we do the tenon, I'm just going to take a look at the uh, price on the carrots. Because they need selling. I ain't got enough money to buy the uh, soup factory or the serve factory. Um, what am I looking at? Price. Right down the bottom for carrots. Four hundred and thirty-five pound. Uh, July is the best price anyway for five hundred and sixteen. So it's only a hundred. Only about ninety-five pound. Right, we'll jump out of that. We'll jump into this tractor. This tractor or the Massey? Where is the Massey? Oh, the mass is on the food mixer, isn't it? Hello, ladies. How are you, my little brown Swiss? Let's top you up while we're here. We'll deal with, we'll sell some milk in the next episode. We need to make sure we've got plenty of food for them and we don't run out. Right, they've took all that. Nice. So, yeah, I need to get bowel storage and, um, oh, what else? I just had it in my mind. Oh, yeah, shed to. Uh, for this to sit in but for now I suppose this can be sat just over here yeah perfect right let's get to Ted and I still haven't decided if we're doing all hay or doing hay and silage I'm humming and harring. I think it'd be best to do all hay and then next time we cut the grass and the green rye we do it all silage. Because that yeah, I think that's what we'll do. So let's get to Tedden. I'll ted a couple of fields and then I'll jump cut the rest and do a couple of fields baling. So let's go on the final time lapse.
Well, this has been one massive job. Cutting the grass, tedding the grass, windrowing it. I think I'm going to bail it in the next episode. So if everyone enjoyed the episode, hit the thumbs up. If you haven't done already, hit the subscribe button. If you want to share this video, be my guest. And I'll see you all in the next one. See you later, gang.